shoot, shoot, shoot review. One, two, one, two, it's the shoot review. I'm super into running shoes and sportswear in general. I'll probably be reviewing some clothes as well at some point. Um, but I'm going to start with a shoe review. I love running shoes. I love also just running shoes that look great just to wear walking about and stuff. But I have way too many of those. So recently I've been trying to get back into the gym a lot more and I was looking for some really good actual running shoes to run in because I do run and uh, as well as work out in. This is the first one I'm going to review. It's called the Pure Boost X Adidas. Okay, so this is it, Pure Boost X. I have one on. Ooh. I love Adidas running shoes in general. So I have a very wide foot and I have a very high arch and I find Adidas shoes really, really good for that. I guess Adidas is my very favorite brand along with Asics. I really like Asics also. So Adidas can be a little more affordable sometimes than Asics. Um, you know, they don't cost $200 usually, like an A6 would. So for these, um, I bought these mainly for running on the treadmill, because it's winter, and for working out at the gym, okay? Not too picky when I work out, it's mainly my running I worry about. So these are meant for running and training, and um, I also bought them because they're super cute. So they're very cute, they have a floral design, love that. It's blue. I don't have any blue shoes. I have a lot of pink and purple. <laughs> so I really like that. I like the design. I tried them on and they felt like amazing. So they support my arch. I have a very high arch. This thing here, I don't know if you can see, there's, they call this the, let me see, on their site here it says the Boost Midsole. So the Boost is the trademark midsole. Um, is a game changer with its endless supply of light fast energy. Okay, so yeah, I, I did really like this because I have a high arch and I really like that it supported my arch there. It wasn't a flat shoe, so that was awesome. Um, and I put them on and they're so lightweight, they, they feel just like clouds, like it's just like a, a magical feeling when you put them on. They're supporting your arch and they're light and they're bouncy. They do feel like they're giving you a real boost. So I really, those were the pluses of this shoe. Now this shoe is beautiful and all those other good, so it's gorgeous shoe and it came in many other beautiful patterns so there was uh, like a pinky flower one they didn't have that in my size I would have got that um, the blue flower there were many different things in beautiful colors really like uh, in with the season colors okay so there were a lot of different choices there's also plain black um, so it's beautiful and it felt terrific when I first put it on um, now in Adidas I usually wear my actual shoe size just because they're, they're wider I find their shoes and so I can wear my real shoe size. I don't have to go up. In Nike I sometimes have to go up a half size. In Adidas I wear my real shoe size. So I got my real shoe size and as soon as I started wearing them <laughs> I found they were pretty loose and flailing off. So they feel, for me, uh, maybe I should have gone, someone should have told me to go down a size. They feel very um, floppy. They feel floppy, like when I'm working out, not if I'm just walking around, they're great for just walking around and looking cute in, um, but when I'm working out, I wouldn't even attempt running in them because I've been doing burpees and push-ups and stuff like that and my foot has been feeling like it's going to fall out of them. So I guess I should have gone down a half size or a size, I'm not sure. And for me it's crazy, um, I have super wide feet. Um, but these actually feel like a little too wide near the ball of the foot in the middle of the foot there It feels a bit like Like my foot is like Sloppy in there like it's just flying about like I'm I'm my foot's rolling out a bit because it's not being held So I don't know what that's about so that that's weird because I have super wide feet So I can't even imagine someone with you know like a normal width foot <laughs> or narrow feet uh oh Stay away from them if you have narrow feet. But they do feel really great. I will wear them as walking around shoes, I guess. Not real workout shoes, which kind of sucks because I was buying them for running workout shoes. They hug your feet with a sock-like arch support. Yeah. Yeah. And they have this funky... You know, all running shoes are getting this now. I'm not sure I'm a fan. So there, it makes it really hard to get them on. I'll show you. It's really hard because it's all, okay, I don't have a sock on right now, but 
it's, it's all stretchy and you have to put it in and then like it, you can't just shove your foot in and these are pretty big on me even because they're so soft, right? You can't just put, put it on the ground and shove it in, right? So um, that's a little annoying. I find that annoying. Um, but it is soft and it feels like this stretchy sock around your ankle, which is kind of nice. I like that. Um, I don't know, a lot of shoes are being made like this with this kind of stretchy thing in here. It's not a real tongue. It's like all part of the shoe. I'm not sure. I like how it looks and feels, but it's really hard to get on if you're just running outside, you know, quickly. I want to walk my dog. I can't just shove my shoes on quickly. It's like I have to like, get down and do a lot. Um, the other thing about these, I would recommend tying them super tight, especially if you're thinking of running in them, because they do feel very, very loose here for me. I don't know. Maybe I need a smaller size. I, I'm not sure. So that's my take on these. Tie them tight. I wouldn't run in them. I wouldn't run any marathons in these. Um, <laughs> I wouldn't even run five minutes on the treadmill at the gym the other day in these. So, because they, they do, they feel like they're falling off my heel a little bit. Like, it feels unstable. It feels floppy. I don't like that in a running shoe. I like to feel like something is holding me. And you'd think they would because of this sock thing. But anyways, they're gorgeous. I will wear them just for fun, hanging out in the summertime. Summertime fun. They're great. Pure Boost X, but for uh, working out, mm, not so much. Shoot, shoot, shoe review. One, two, one, two, it's the shoe review.